Hi. Hello. Welcome to my channel. magic. Do, I'm gonna do this. You're gonna trim it. Okay. So today I'm gonna be filming a get ready with me. I don't have anything to talk about so you're just gonna watch me paint my face. So this is the Morphe concealer in the shade C 2.35. Normally this is all I wear so I'm gonna do my like everyday makeup but with an eyeshadow because I'm going to church today so Does anybody else get a little red under the nose? Oh no, never mind. It's because I have allergies. And if I need more, I will apply more. Who got me sick? Um, I normally blend out all my um, all my liquid products that go on my face with a brush just because I found that like brushes don't take as much product as a normal um, sponge would and this is a BH Cosmetics brush the flat brush for um, foundation and I can't remember the name of it. I, I'm sure it had number because it was a whole rose gold set. And um, got it like over a year ago. Possibly two years ago. Hmm. There we go. I bring it down the best of my ability and like smear it everywhere as much as I could so it can blend because like I said I only put concealer where I need to conceal mostly and then paint the rest of my face with it um, because I'm doing eyeshadow I'm probably gonna put a little bit more on my lids and it dries pretty matte and I like that this is fun fact the only concealer that I found that's like affordable because I think it's nine dollars <throat> that does not give me an allergic reaction because I've tried many concealers from like Ulta you know different brands and like I had a bad allergic reaction to them and I was given this one product that was came out as a facial product first for like dermatology reasons and um it was Clinique and they came out with a concealer they have like a makeup line and it didn't give me any problems. It was twenty dollars, and I'm not trying to spend twenty dollars every time I run out. Um. Okay. Wait. Can I take a? I don't like my dimpled side. I don't even know if I took a picture. Okay. Um. Okay. I'll go with pink. <clears throat> my favorite color, anyway. Somebody probably got me sick. They were like, she's gonna treat us this good and leave? Nah. I don't even have my good brushes on me. Help! Is this gonna be, like, can I fast forward this? What do you mean, like, make it fast? Yeah, I didn't even check on my things. Wow. Like, on my settings? Yeah, I don't know what you mean, though. Like, oh. <laughs> Yeah, she's changing. Uh, I'm gonna be going in with this shade right here, my transitioning shade. Uh, I'll put it in my crease. Oh, okay. And just pack it in my crease. Because <clears throat> I probably am gonna do pink. That's some glue residue that you're probably seeing. It's okay. I'm okay with it. You should be okay with it. And I'm going to be grabbing a different brush. Oops, I forgot to show you this one. And this one, it's a little bit angled. 
I was gonna do a rustic red, but I think I'm just gonna go into like the burgundy color just because I'm gonna do pink and I use it lightly. Why does this look dumb? Oh, I'm grabbing um, this blending brush, crease brush, <clears throat> to blend the outside with the transitioning color that I had already used, just to blend it all together, because that was looking harsh, which it normally does in a makeup look when you're starting anyway. There we go. <clears throat> but it just wasn't to my liking. I guess I should practice my makeup more often because little did I know this brush would do something great. I'm trying to figure out if I want to um, give myself a cut crease or make it super deep. Or I can just add a glitter, like something super shimmery. You can't see. I'm going to have to try it out. I'm going to use this little brush to pack in some glitter because that's what I'm going to be using, glitter. Shimmer. Mm. I haven't been doing a lot of talking because I have nothing to talk about. I'm probably not even going to post this video if I'm being honest. <clears throat> I get a little ballsy with it. This is not something I, okay. I should have cut my crease. You can't even tell. You can hear my family in the back. Okay, next, I don't know if I should start on my eyeliner. Oh. Do I want to wear eyeliner? You know what? <clears throat> Am I going to contour today? Should I? At least it's like precise. This isn't even like a get ready with me. This isn't even a get ready with me. You're just watching me getting ready. I don't know. Oh, my baby girl. I love her. I'm using this cream contour kit that I got um, a while back. I'm gonna be honest, I like never do anything to my eyebrows, hardly ever. And now that I have blonde in the front of my head, I try to avoid using my pomade as much as I normally did. Not even normally, like I hardly ever used it just because my eyebrows are already thick as it is and have like a, a good amount of hair. All I do is um, carve them with concealer. That's it. Occasionally, I'll fill them. Like if I have little bald spots, which I do, but I like not regularly. I don't regularly um, fill them. So I'm gonna do that right now with concealer. Show you guys.
I guess I'm gonna start on my lashes. My eyelashes are so much longer than what I thought they were. I always like, how do I say it? I'm always negative about myself. I mean, not always, I used to be, but ever since I've been appreciating myself more, um, I noticed like nice things about me. I'm just like smiling because I just remembered that I'm filming this video and I was with a friend last night and they were telling me how I was telling them how I was gonna film a video today and post it and they're like oh good I subscribed to you and it just made me so happy that like people are supporting me for like the littlest thing that's how my day is going it's on my nose. I never get it on my nose too. It's probably because I'm distracted and I'm talking. That's so pretty. Just kidding. How am I gonna take this off? With a brush that hasn't been used. And with the brush that I was using for my concealer. Ojitos. Okay, eyeliner. I have to. I was, I got this um, Kat Von D eyeliner that I was going to show you guys. But you know what? I'm just going to use my brown eyeliner because brown is where it's at. No, I'm just going to use it. I'm just going to use it. I got makeup all over my shirt. You know what? This looks really, this looks so much better than what I thought. I mean, Okay, eyeliner check. Lash glue, I cannot stress enough. It works so good. It's the duo, and I think it's the aloe vera one. It's green. And like, this has last, lasted me like some of the best nights. And even the worst nights, like it's just comes in clutch. It, it works really good. I only do it so that I know like which one goes where. That looks good. Hi. Hello. Welcome to my channel. I'm gonna line my lips with um, a lip liner. 25, it's Earth Tone, obviously it's a nude. That's the shade color, Earth Tone. It's a nude. All I use are nudes. Um, I always use a gloss over it. I stopped using matte lips like last year, at the beginning of the year maybe. So I'm gonna line my lips. And I'm gonna be using the Milani. It's a Milani lip gloss. Honestly, I forgot what shade it was and I already ran out. But it's in the shade Tropical Shine. Mm. I like it, but it's not that pink. So I have this one, it's a Victoria's Secret one. It's called Get Glossed. And the shade is Peekaboo. You know what? I didn't do my lower lash line. Did I do it? 
Should I add more color to my face? Everything's gonna be okay. And this is the finished product. Um, as you can see, it's not a lot, but that's okay. I don't wear a lot of makeup anyway. I don't wear as much as I used to. Mm. What else? That's it. But like I said, this is, I don't know, like, I like this.